Hello and welcome to the last day of E3 2014. We've played some games, we've watched some games, we've watched an awful lot of people play games that we weren't allowed to play. But regardless, it's time to give up some awards to the very best things that we've seen at the show. The things that really stuck out in our hearts and our minds. And yeah, so Sam and I are going to traipse around the show floor, hand out some awards rather awkwardly. And uh, Jim's not feeling very well, so we'll see how we get on. All right, to the show floor. Okay, we're here with Ryan from Insomniac Games. Yeah. Uh, now, obviously, we're giving our awards out now. Of course. Uh, we want to give one to Sunset Overdrive. Yes. I don't know whether you've known, but over the last few years, uh, sort of heroes and protagonists in games, they're becoming more annoying, more obnoxious, you know, they're loud mouthy and they bitch and moan. I'm, I'm happy to tell you this year, you have won Video Gamers the Asshole Protagonist Award. We think yes. your guy is the biggest asshole we've seen. <laughs> he's good? mouthy, he's wordy, he doesn't shut up. He kind of bitched and moaned at us a bit, but you know what? You've done it. You've won the Asshole Protagonist Award, so thank you very much. You, just, you created I an asshole. More, I couldn't be more honored to accept this on behalf Please of Please put it on the wall. Please. I will. Why does it... I'm so short sure right. stuff to put up just there. Just stick it over anything. It's the best award. <laughs> There right you there, go. That's perfect. There we go. Asshole protagonist. Well, the best. I'm like, I... The best asshole protagonist. Yes. Thank you very much, man. That was Take care. Rainbow Six, a lovely surprise this year. Uh, made the presentations a little bit more exciting, I think, and uh, a lot of people really enjoyed seeing it. Uh, the, the, the level you showed off, obviously, the lot of destruction on display, that, that house seems really detailed and uh, really real. And so we're very proud to award you the, uh, the most detailed in-game ceilings of E3 2014. So there you are. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Um, Thank you. Cheers, man. So obviously on the E3 uh, show floor, what they always love to do, they always love to put a car somewhere. I don't know why. Maybe it's something to do with, you know, manlyhood. Uh, so obviously this year we've got best car on show floor. It's an important award, very important award, we think. And obviously, where else are we going to start? Microsoft love their driving games. They've got Forza this year, and you may have seen it in the background as we go. There it is. That's a pretty, pretty, pretty nice car. But that's not good enough. Look at that. It's a fucking disgrace. Did you get it? All right, we couldn't actually grab any of the developers from Dawngate this year. Unfortunately, they've had to set off early. But we've got Stephanie here from EA, who I'm very pleased to award this to. It's uh, good luck with your MOBA. Obviously, a very competitive genre to enter. <laughs> We are at Alien Isolation. It's a game that we played a few times now. Really enjoyed it. You even managed to put guns into the game without messing it up, and just well done on that on that regard. Um, so we are very proud to give you our Game of the Year uh, at this year's E3, and it's most likely to help us forget about the impending heat death of the universe. Oh, award, that is an amazing uh, award. For Alien Isolation. Yes. Thank you. Thank you to everyone. Oh. Very well deserved. Okay, so I'm sure you've seen C3's, the big show. Uh, there's a lot of innovation, a lot of originality going on. Uh, and I'm sure you see a lot of it. People are doing things they've never done before. And I'm, for one, I'm really impressed that you did this. I was a big fan of House of Cards. So the fact that you've got Kevin Spacey in your game, I just want to give you the best use of Kevin Spacey. Well done. You did it. You did it. Congratulations. <laughs> You're joking, right? What do you mean? That looks bloody familiar, doesn't it? How do you mean? We don't have Kevin Spacey in our game. You don't? No, Should I accept the no, award? I know. I know. <laughs> I don't know Kevin Spacey. What? <laughs> this, this guy thinks I don't know Kevin Spacey's game. What we mean is, not putting Kevin Spacey in your game ah, is the best use of Kevin Spacey. Fantastic. So we want to give you the best. Obviously, so I don't know that Kevin Spacey's not in your game. Come on. I'm pro it's a professional, professional website. Oh, so well. I, I want to give this to you. It's got his face on it and everything. That's fantastic. Good, good use. Well done. Well, thank you, sir. You, you did it. We appreciate it. It, no it was problem. a lot of not work, but it's, it's we didn't one. try very hard at all, and I really appreciate this award. That's the video game MO. <laughs> don't work hard and see what happens. <laughs> All right then, here we are at Forza Horizon 2, and we've got an award to give, of course we have. I think it was last year, we, um, we first heard Drive Atar, and you know, it, it's probably been our favorite word of the show. And so we'd like to 
to award you for sticking with it, showing it as this this time this year, and award you with Bollocks Buzz Word, because it's been our absolute favourite Bollocks Buzz Word of E3, both this year and last year, and you need to be commended for it. So well, thank you. Here we are. You got to, uh, to work it on? You got to get the tape. Yes, yes, oh, so sad. Yeah. Thank you. Excellent. So, uh, we're from videogamer.com, we give out these awards every year, yep. and after scouring the show floor and thinking about the history, you've got a lot of history in doing this, you do it a lot, you really sell your game, you sell it week by week, day by day, at 5pm, we know we're going to get it, we know we're going to get it, and we know we're going to have so many of them, so we're pleased to give you the Destined to Have the Most Trailers Award for uh -huh. Assassin's Creed Unity, because right. Ubisoft are damn good at putting out trailers. Thank you very so much. So thank you very much, thank you very much, and good luck with your game. Thanks, thank man. you. <laughs> Amazing. And there we are, that's the end of E3 2013. We've still got some more video stuff to come later down the line, but we're pretty much done here at the show. It's been a weird one. A lot of games that aren't coming out until next year. Some good stuff on the show floor, but nothing to really write home about. Um, so yeah, E3 2014, it's been all right. See ya.